Hello, in this video we are gonna do a mailer send review and see how this service can help us uh, send the transactional emails for our business or our application. So mailer send it is a transactional email solution that can uh, help you send uh, API emails or SMTP emails and uh, these are some of uh, his features you see here like uh, email API, SMTP relay, you can do this with, with this. You can have dy dynamic e email templates, you have inbound routing, you have the email verifications, SMS notifications will be added next. And also the services, it is offering a free plan that has about 12,000 uh, monthly emails that is should be more than enough for the most. In this uh, video, we're gonna see exactly uh, what MailerSend has to, to offer. Okay, this uh, MailerSend service was created by the ones behind the MailerLite. That is a marketing uh, email solution. And uh, I have it configured in one of my domain, the MailerSend. So we can see exactly what it has behind and how what uh, is happening there. I've also written an article with uh, all of these details where you can see the futures and everything that this service, uh, that this service has and also my opinions about it and some alternatives that we're gonna see also in this, in this video. So let's, let's go and, and see first, let's start with the features that this, uh, this solution has. So yeah, as I told you, you have these options to send these uh, emails, you have the analytics options, you have the inbound routing uh, options to receive emails and uh, react based on what is in that email. This is not this is not included in the free in the fee plan. The fee plan it's it's, it's like this. You you have uh, these options in the free plan, like 12,000 emails, but to access these 12,000 emails, you need to verify your account and uh, uh, input your uh, credit card details. Otherwise, you have only one, 100 emails that you can send. So these are the features included in the free. You have um, access to the email notification solution. You can create up to three templates. You can add one domain. Have a, 1000 daily API request and seven days data retentions. If you want the pro option, you can uh, you can have also that, but it will start at about $25 a month for 50,000 emails and uh, 100 SMSs. You have also 100 email verification credits and um, some extra options that are included in, in here is like the inbound routing that you will have. Also, you have some options that we're going to see in the in the dashboard that will be activated. And for every 1,000 emails sent, you will need to pay 90 cents. For the, the free plan, you will pay, if you go beyond this 12,000 limit, you will pay $1 for 1,000 emails. So the price is quite, quite decent. So if we're going to go behind, this is the dashboard in here where I have added my, my domain. In here, in here is, you have access to the, to the reports, but in here, if you go, you see the domain that is added. You just need to go in the beginning and, uh, and add your domain, uh, domain in here. It is verified. Uh, so the process to add it is just uh, like any other uh, SMTP uh, providers. You see here, you have the DNS records. You just need to go and copy them and add them to your uh, DNS provider. This is, is the SPF. You can use multiple uh, uh, transactional email services if you if you want. For instance, in here, here you see that I have the Zeto Mail and Sending Blue on, and Mailer Send that it's on the same domain, obviously for some testing reasons. And uh, you need to go in the DNS and add them. You see here like uh, I've added the TXT record with what they are sending there, and you need to do the same for uh, for all of this uh, for all of this record. The key you need to to create a C name 
that will point to mailers and you have these options to custom DMS records if you want to activate the inbound domain forwarding but it's not activating on this on this domain so after you put all of this on your domain DNS you will verify the records after these records they are verified they are manually approving your domain to to their service so uh, you you will also need to uh, to be aware of that which you, you will not be, be just enabled you will need to wait for them to approve your domain but this happened in about one hour for me so it was very fast okay so this is the dns records and this is what what it's it, it's in here so in here we have the dashboard as i told you this is the default one and here you have some reports initially with the emails that were sent and rejected if we go here and we check let's go and see the details in uh, uh, in here yeah this is there you have the option to generate an api token if you are using the api to send emails for this domain for inbound routing you have the uh, you, you need to have you upgrade your plan for that you need to go to the next version like the one with the 20 25 dollars this one the premium one in here i have activated smtp so, so i can create an um, SNTP relay on the VPS that I that I have. In here you 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 have the details that you need to, to put for that. And in here, for instance, you have some options that you can enable in the free option. You can track opens, you can track clicks. The content is not tracked in here. You need to go to upgrade. Cost customize heading name the same. You need to add the custom subdomain for, for this. And in here you have the advanced settings, uh, like you can create uh, unsubscribe pages, subscriptions, API in instruction in here for if you want to create uh, an application and how and the, how you can use their their API. Okay. Next in here we have the sender identities. In, we don't have this uh, enabled in the free plan we need to upgrade to use this but this will enable you to add different uh, dom domains and send emails to behalf of that domain with this account in the activity you have the reports with the emails that 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 were sent and the uh, status in here you have the options to create template for this so you have some predefined template that uh, are already in here and you can create your own template for instance you, you can create a template one or with different layouts for for instance when uh, an order is sent with WooCommerce and uh, things things like that these templates are are um, enabled in the email with the help of uh, the API so you cannot act, enable them when using the SNT, SNTP in here you can test them yeah this is just a basic template this is how it's enabled uh, like this is it's showing you can edit it you can test it for instance in the edit you can add everything you want in in here you have the options in the right side that you can can add and make it look as you as you like yeah you have the content so yeah these are templates you can customize three templates in the free plan and you can use them for your emails if, if you want but this will work with the api only okay Let's, let's see next the analytics okay go back analytics it will help you see reports about uh, emails sent about 
open rate uh, clicks and things like that are bouncy. So bouncy see here you see you have the options to, to, to specify a period in, in days. And in here you have the email volume. Let's open and clicks. They are hard and soft bounces and you have also open location and other things. But yeah, I'm using this service for about uh, one, one week and a half. And this is what uh, what was added in in here. So there aren't a lot of uh, in details for this for this account. But if you are sending a lot of emails, you have these tracking options. And if you click, for instance, the processed one that happened in here, you you'll have the details with the subjects. You don't you will not see the message in here because this is only in available in in the pro options okay suppression here you can block certain uh, uh, certain email accounts or email can are not sent you have the error log in here you have the email verification feature that uh, you need to uh, you need to pay for uh, for uh, using it so it's like uh, one uh, euro for one uh, account verified one dollar like this and in here we have the account settings with my details api tokens if you create and you have a file manager in here for files that you are going to use in in your emails and yeah that's about it or the dashboard of this this product. The next thing is our integration. So this service has also integrations that will help you. For instance, you have integration with WooCommerce. This will uh, this is actually a plugin that will help you uh, help you activate the mailer sent for WooCommerce. So have other emails that are gonna be sent from WooCommerce, you're gonna use Mailer Send. The other thing that you can do with this service is to create some custom templates and you can uh, you activate them on the WooCommerce emails that are sent. So you can create various templates for the uh, order that it's sent and yeah, communications that are in the WooCommerce when an order is delivered, things like that you can assign various templates based on, on that and you can customize emails with your branding and they'll take care of this uh, for for one for me this is a nice feature but in the the problem is that in the free version you will only have the uh, three templates that you can use it can be enough if you if you only activate it for only certain communications the email templates and that's the default one for the rest in here we have also the WordPress, the default WordPress that doesn't have the uh, WooCommerce installed, but this is based on the SMTP and you will not be able to activate any template for it. And this is like a mi minus. They could have uh, done some things in here that could uh, enable you to activate some template templates based on, for instance, if a comment or password is reset it things like that, it, they can, could have done more. So it will be, it will have been good to have these this options. Okay, other integrations that you can, that you can have in this with it, it's Zapier, Public Connect, for instance, you can go in here. You will see that this integration is to, uh, to notify you in case of certain things happens. You see here, if you're charging Stripe or in PayPal, you have a refund, things like that. You can uh, <clears throat> you can uh, explore this more and activate uh, activate some notification with Zapier. Similar with Public Connect, you can link it to the Public Connect and create uh, events in, in in there. The other options that you can do with this is to create webhooks also. So uh, uh, in case uh, an action is happening on your application, 
you will trigger that webhook webhook and they will they will uh, register that uh, that that for you to have the to have the detailed report so this in is in big mailer send uh, you have uh, some alternatives to mailer send if you are, are not okay with this service i will present you a few they are also having a few emails that can uh, you can use and some of the the best it's the sending blue one in here you have the sending blue it's doing the similar things that uh, uh, mailer send it's, it's doing it also has more details because this is a more uh, this is a more uh, mature product but uh, for the free and the SMTP options can send up to 300 emails per day per, per day for free and uh, yeah in, in in there you can uh, let me change this you see here like uh, in the free options you have also the email template that you can create uh, sms you can uh, uh, you can add and based on the features you need you can activate different 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 plans this is more expensive than um, than mailer light other free options that you can use it's send green this will enable you to send one hundred free mails a day okay let me accept this so in here you'll have the similar uh, similar features that you have in the mailer send you will see that you have like api says ntp relay webhooks you have dynamic templates vulnerability insights reports you have email validations but with the upper plans this is an uh, uh, decent priced service you have 100 emails a day for free and then you you are paying uh, for for instance for 50,000 emails you'll pay about $20 a month and you'll have more access to to their futures so yeah this is another good alternative to mail, mail or send if you want other alternative is mailgun is doing similar things that mail, mail or send it's, it's doing SNTP relay and uh, and this it's offering about 5,000 emails a month for free so it's not even half of what mailer send it's offering and you have similar similar features like mailer send another good alternative is, is this zepto mail let me copy it this is from uh, zoho and uh, what this uh, cost it, it doesn't have a uh, few options but in, in here basically you buy credits on one credit has 10,000 emails and uh, for one credit you pay about uh, two dollars and, and a half it's available for six months so this is a nice alternative to to mailer send but uh, you are limited because you can only you can only use it on, as a SMTP API or SMTP relay and uh, you can create websites and doubts about it you have some reports in there but this is the the details that this tool offers right now the thing is that it's very decent priced from my point of view see here you only pay about two dollars and a half for ten thousand emails Let's try to put here like 1000 here like 10 credits should be we only paid 25 dollars for 10,000 mails which is pretty good okay so this is uh, the mailer send uh, review uh, if you want and uh, you liked this this tool can give it a try for for free Thanks for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe and like the video if you enjoy it. Have a nice day.